the six fastest times of the non-winners will also qualify. It is possible then that you could finish second and not make the final. So they'll have one eye on their opponents and one eye on the clock. And it looks like one of the French skaters has decided to get off early. And it's the familiar figure of D'Souza, but he gives way. And uh, Livio Wenger, who also had a very good world championship, was just outside the medals. Peter Michael tucked in behind him as well, who was the gold medalist in that world championship when Wenger came in fourth. A really high-class field. Mareshi was also a finalist in the world championship. And they're continuing just to jostle and jockey for position here as we hit 600 metres. Uh, the lead continuing to change. Michael very much at the head of affairs. And the Argentinian Capellano is the one that's struggling at the back and I think has more or less said, you know what, this isn't going to be my day, but is it going to be Peter Michael's day? He's got D'Souza for company and here comes the other Frenchman as well, Wendal Le Piver. But they're trying to hit the home straight here. And Peter Michael has taken that. So he's guaranteed to be through. Now, how many of those following will follow?